How to add and edit links. If you take a look at this example, you'll see the blog roll. These are the default WordPress links. Now to change all these links or delete them, simply go to your WordPress dashboard, go to the links section, and let's go to all links. We don't need any of these links. We want to feature our own links. So what I would do is select all and let's delete all of them. The first thing I want to do is go to link categories. I don't want to call my category blog roll. As you can see, blog roll. I want to call it resources. So what I would do is add a new category called resources. Now I add new link category and now you can see it here. Now I would add a new link and call this link Top Golf Resources and then enter a web address. The description is not necessary and then select the category you want it to be placed in. I just created resources. I'm going to click resources. Now you can add the target. Blank will open in a new tab. Top will open in the current window or tab with no frames and none will open it in the same window. I would recommend you open it in the new window. We don't need any of these options. So we're just going to scroll back on top and click add link. So now it says link added. If I refresh my blog, you'll see the link section here. And here's my link, Top Golf Resources. That's a clickable link, which goes to the website I specified when I added a new link. If you don't see the link section on your blog, that means that you haven't activated the links. To do so, go to appearance, go to widgets, and make sure that the links widget is added in one of these widget areas. If you don't see it, then you'll see available widgets on the left side here, and then you simply drag it to the area you'd like.